He's got the markings of a Clydesdale with that white stripe and white legs. <laughs> Looking good. Yes, yes, yes. We're just trying to get a good. Looks like John Sheriff is doing his zen on that horse. Great, you can get straight in front of it. Save with his hands on. Just a better shot. Stay on. Getting him calm down. That was authentic. That just passed in front of him, the four horse. Here. Well, this is nice and calm. And here comes Thousand Words, the five horse right there, just passed in front of us. There's number six, Storm the Court, two year old champion. His calm touch with this horse has got him really settled down. He's not turning a hair, as they say. Looks like Storm the Court's ready for action here. A very leggy colt. Peter's putting a non-slip wet chamois cloth on, on first, then the foam saddle pad, the number cloth. just behind Honor AP, the four horse. I was speaking to Bob Baffert just a couple days ago. He thinks Authentic's a better horse than a thousand words. And there's Authentic getting the saddle on. <laughs> He's got a neck strap for the jockey to grab hold of coming out of the gate. All the trainers, Peter Erton on Storm the Court, Bob Baffert, just giving his horse a pat, getting that, that touch, that hand on there for a little security. And the horses do respond to that. Whoa! <laughs> Took a little swipe at Bob. Uh -huh. <laughs> Stall there. Yes, and she was Miguel and Charlton. <laughs> Peter is going to put the tongue tie on Storm the Court. Authentic's already got his tongue tie on.
Good luck, John. For our YouTube channel. Do you gallop? Um, Honor AP? I have. And? Apparently, no, but I have. Oh, he's one of the best. Very, very nice. Long stride? Long stride. Smooth? Smooth. Don't even hit the ground. Yeah. yeah. Good head? Good head. He travels all distances with easy strides. Yeah. Eats up the ground. Huh? Yeah. Just fight. You'll see it right now. Well, you're looking at. One of the riders for Honor AP. Mark, what's your last name? Mark Witkowski. Witkowski. Yeah. This, is, this is the way horse racing should be racing. Like this. This, way, this could be a better race than the Kentucky Derby. It's not a 20 horse field, you know? And you got these are the best. Yeah. This thing, this thing, one point eight for the Authentic wins this race easily, and you can see he's very professional about it, just straight as an arrow all the way down the stretch, no problems with the crowd or any distractions. A big difference from his previous race, and we'll compare the two right here. That's his previous race on top, and look at him turning his head, leaning in towards the rail, gets straightened out a little bit, then shies towards the rail again. I think this was probably from the crowd noise, and Baffert left the earplugs in for this entire race. He usually takes them out at the uh, starting gate, but he left the earplugs in for this whole race, and it seems to have really made the difference. <laughs> Lots of drama today at San Anita in the San Felipe Stakes. Authentic was the big winner. He picks up 50 points for the Kentucky Derby. Second place finisher, Honor AP, earned 10 points towards the Derby. I'm sure we haven't seen the last of him. We've got the Santa Anita Derby coming up. I don't know if John Sheriffs will send Honor AP to the Santa Anita Derby, but I'm pretty sure Baffert will be sending Authentic there because I heard him say he was going to be keeping Authentic here at Santa Anita. I think Thousand Words ran a disappointing race, stormed the court, ran really well, finished third. You can't make too many assumptions here. Authentic certainly looks like the best horse on the West Coast, but the Kentucky Derby's a mile and a quarter. Could be a whole different ball game. Well, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll be making a few more videos on Derby prospects in the coming weeks. Also, Bob Baffert has a terrific filly that will very likely be heading for the Kentucky Oaks. Her name is Gammon. 
I'll be doing a video on her right away. So keep watching for new videos. Again, thanks for watching and good luck at the races. Thank you.